Welcome to part 1 of the Xeno Instant Video Tutorial. In this quick video, you will learn 4 simple steps to connect your camera to the Xeno Instant Mobile app. This is a very important step for new users to learn before using Xeno Instant. After this video, make sure to watch part 2 of the Xeno Instant Video Tutorial. You will learn how to create an instant gallery on the desktop and customize important features such as delivery settings, e-store, watermarks, AI culling, and more. Now, let's get started. Step 1. Download the Xeno Instant app. Search Xeno Instant in your App Store. Make sure you download the latest version of the app, or update if you downloaded an old version before. For iPhone users, after download, remember to go into your phone, Settings, and allow full access to the Xeno Instant app. This is a very important step to ensure successful connection. Step 2. Set up a test instant gallery. Now, open the Xeno Instant app. Log in with your email and password. Now, you are on the home screen. Tap the new instant gallery button on the top right corner. An in-app message will appear, reminding you that setup is limited on mobile. Be sure to watch part two of the Xeno Instant video tutorial, so you will learn all the useful features Xeno Instant offers on the desktop. Accept and close the message. Enter a name for your test gallery. Choose a location. Now your test gallery is created. Tap the back arrow to return to the home screen. Now you should see the test gallery you just created. If not found, quickly pull down the page to refresh. Step 3. Connect the app to your camera. Now open your mobile tethering kit. Make sure you choose the correct cable based on your phone, camera brand, and model. After you connect your phone and camera, go to the Xeno Instant app home screen. Find the test gallery you created earlier. Tap the Upload button. The app will prompt you to select various connection options. For this tutorial video, let's just go with all the default options. Now tap OK. A pop-up message will appear, now asking for access permission to the camera. Make sure you select Allow to give permission to the Xeno Instant app. Now you should see two green buttons on the screen. The first green button says connect USB and the second shows your camera model. If you see both green buttons, your phone and camera connection is working now. You are good to move on to the last step. If your screen shows one or two red buttons saying disconnect USB or inactive, your connection is not working yet. Here are a couple quick tips to troubleshoot. Tip one, turn your camera off and back on Check in the app and see if you now get the two green buttons. If still seeing the red buttons, try Tip 2. Restart your mobile phone. If still having trouble, please contact our support team. Step 4. Test photo delivery. Make sure your camera is set to shoot in RAW plus JPG, since Xeno Instant accepts JPG files. Now, take a couple photos. You should see the photos appear in the gallery within seconds. One final step. Let's see if your guests can also see the photos you just took. Click back to the home screen and find your test gallery. Now tap the share button. The QR code and link for your test gallery should appear. Ask a friend or use a second phone to scan the QR code. You should see the gallery with all the photos you just took. Congratulations! You now know how to connect your camera with the Xeno Instant app. And you can know how to share your photos instantly with guests. Remember to watch part two of the Xeno Instant video tutorial. You will learn how to create an instant gallery on the desktop and customize important features such as delivery settings, e-store, watermarks, AI culling, and more. You can find the link to that video in the video description.